Hi kids, welcome to the world of computers. Today, I will talk about how exactly a computer works. Do you remember what is a computer? Right, a computer is a machine. Like most machines, it can't work on its own. You already know that a computer has many parts. Do you remember them? Look at the picture of it and tell the different parts of computer. Monitor, CPU, keyboard and mouse. These are the basic parts of computer. Okay, now tell me how does a computer work? A computer works in three basic steps. That is input, process and output. And that cycle is known as IPO cycle. One simple example explain to you input, process and output. When your mother prepare a cake for you, how does she go about, about it? Look at this carefully. Step number one. Input. First she put cake flour, sugar and egg. That is all the ingredients into the blender. This is input. You are familiar with the word in. Putting something in. Input. Step number two. Process. She switches on the blender and the blades of the blender rotate and mix the ingredients. This is process. Step number three. Output. Finally, a delicious cake is ready. Ready to eat. This is the output. In the same way, to do any work in a computer, you have to follow these three simple steps. Which are the steps? Yes. Receive input. Process information. Then the result is ready. The output is ready. Let us see one by one. What is input? The input consists of the data and instructions we put into the computer. These are done by the input device, uh, either keyboard or mouse. Next is process. A computer then works on the data by using the instruction. CPU is known as the brain of the computer. It does the processing. And next is output. The result we get after processing is called output. Monitor is the device which gives us the result. So, what is the summary? We studied the working of the computer. It has three steps. That is the input, process and output. And that cycle is known as the IPO cycle. That is all in computer lesson today. Good going.